discussion and possible action to instruct the town's attorneys and rep representatives regarding the property commonly known as the former Vistoso Golf Course. It would be nice to hear a progress report on the first meeting that um, that you already may have had with Romsman, if at all possible. Uh, reiterate that I will um, be an advocate and support of a community sponsored um, funding of a fair market value. You know, we, we've shown our financial support all along the way. We'll continue to do so uh, because this is uh, this is just the right thing to do. Thus, my question is, what is the status of the formal appraisal to determine the current fair market value of the property? As stated for many months by Rancho of the Soto residents, purchase of the property is only supported at fair market value. I, I just a little confused. When we had the last meeting, we were told there wasn't going to be a meeting with Romson until January. No date had been set. So we're having this general session tonight to address the golf course property, but we have no idea what we're supposed to be talking about because we've not been given any information about where that process is. So we're asking questions which don't really deal with the current situation. So I guess what I'm asking is what's going on? Let's preserve what we have left of the Sonoran Desert in this area because once it is developed, it is gone forever. It may not be satisfactory, it's not necessarily my fault, but it's because we have some laws with regards to executive session. And that executive session law passed by the Arizona legislature, right or wrong, uh, does not allow me or anybody on the council to discuss uh, what exactly happened in the executive session. We just can't do it. Can't answer any of the questions that were posed. I apologize. Um, but we're obviously talking about the, the Vistoso golf course. I, I move the town attorney and town manager proceed as directed in executive session.